Hey, this is Logan Sullivan, Porsche Pro at God in Porsche of Las Vegas. I'm sitting inside one of our 2023 911s right now that's got one of our newest tech equipment accessories installed to it already. This 911 is equipped with the Porsche dash cam, so that means it's got a dash cam on the front windshield and rear window installed for full-time recording. So let's hop in, let's explore this, and let's see if this is right for your Porsche. In order to ensure that your car is properly set up for dash cam wiring, please reference your build sheet and ensure that it does mention pre-wiring for dash cam. So here is the dash cam itself. This is the front facing dash cam unit. And you can see here, it has the front facing lens that goes out that way. Then facing on my side is the release button if I wanted to remove the dash cam, my expandable storage. So this is my, my micro SD card that will store the front and rear dash cam footage onto here. I can also open up the app and look at the footage through Wi-Fi, or I can remove this and put it into my computer to get the footage from there. The power button is over here. This is also to mute and unmute the internal recording. The initial setup of your Porsche dash cam is going to require you downloading the Porsche dash cam app. From there, you'll be able to connect to the phone to the dash cam directly through Wi-Fi. Additionally, you can connect the dash cam to the vehicle's Wi-Fi and connect your own phone to the car's Wi-Fi and have them meet through there. I've simply chosen to connect the phone directly to the dash cam. Whenever you're going through your initial setup, anything in this menu will stop recording. Once I've left the settings menu, recording will start back up and now is recording live both front and rear. I can click live image and it will actually show me a live image of front and rear. Additionally, I can go to events and video playback, which will stop video recording, and I can refer to the previous footage right there. Depending on your Porsche model, you do have different recording modes that you can choose from. Coming here in modes will let you choose between continuous shock and also parking mode recording. Continuous shock is the idea that it will always be recording events at all times as long as the car is on. It'll also manually make sure it's recording whenever it has any shock sensors that are deployed while you're driving, meaning if you were to hit any bumps or anything like that, it'll ensure that it's recording. I can come here and I can also switch into parking mode depending on my Porsche model. Parking mode is the idea that the car will continue recording while you're parked if there are any incidents, meaning if someone were to hit your car, it'll sense that and turn the dash cam on and record from there. Other settings you can customize would be the microphone being enabled or disabled to record audio inside of the car, the security LED that lets outsiders know that it is currently recording, and the speaker of the dash cam itself to verbally announce different driving modes and recording. I can also come here and I can wipe my SD card or reset the dash cam entirely. This tech equipment accessory adds a whole layer of extra security to your Porsche vehicle. Please check out our website for our tech equipment accessories to see if this is available for your model.